Hi and welcome to ProCAD Online Tutorials. Today I will show you how to properly mirror a part so that when you make changes to original part, the mirrored part will update automatically. Here I have created a random part to be mirrored just for demonstration purposes. It's just some simple part with random features. Next is go to File, New, Create a New Assembly. Now import the part you wish to mirror. So we're going to place the part we've just created. Hit OK. Next what we'll do is um, go to mirror and select the part and then select the plane on which the part is to be mirrored. Then just click next. And now as you can see this will create a new mirrored part with a mirror extension at the end of it. This can be changed if you wish. So next just hit OK. And now that's your part mirrored within the assembly. Now we're just going to save the assembly as this is the reference link between the mirrored part and the original model. Hit yes to all, hit OK. Um, next, to demonstrate the advantage of mirroring the models this way, we will alter some dimensions in our original model and see how this affects the mirrored part. Next, open the original model. You should find it in your project folder that you have set up. Next, you can just change dimensions of any random features on your part. So for example, I'm just going to change the height of extrusions of the little tabs on top of my part. Next, save the changes you have made and then navigate to your assembly to, o to see how the changes have affected our mirrored part. So once again, open it from your project folder. It will ask you to update the changes, hit yes. Now as you can see, changes have been made to the mirrored part also. Now just to double check, we will open the mirrored part as well. And as you can see, all the changes made to the original part have been updated on the mirror part. I hope this video helped and will improve your workflow in the future. And for more online tutorials, follow the YouTube link below or alternatively visit our website.